Welcome everybody, my name is Eduardo Alcaraz Mateos and I'm presenting Digital Pathology and Contact-Free Input Devices for COVID-19 Pandemic. So COVID-19 Pandemic, caused by severe acute respiratory syndrome coronavirus 2, makes touchless control of medical image viewers, including digital pathology, whole slide images, an adequate option to limit exposure since the virus can remain viable on surfaces. So keyboard, mouse, microscope and, of course, glass slides are potential sources of infection contamination. So we have to know that gaze is considered a natural mode of input. It is quite easy to focus on items only by looking at them. It is so intuitive that it requires very little or no training at all. So we decided to compare three free head tracking mouse emulators enabled by a calm mouse and camera mouse. One of the authors reviewed the performance of the three software solutions and a video tutorial was recorded. And as you can see, it's a handless device, so it's a touch-free and only the head movement is detected to control the slides. So four consultant is to pathologist examine 20 dermatopathology cases digitized at 20 times magnification. The NASA test load index was uh, used and it's a widely used instrument to rate the perceived workload. In addition, a 5 point liquor like scale satisfactory survey was used, which include the following components comfort, adaptation time, course of movement, goal achievement, prolonged use, and general satisfaction. Time was recorded. We are presenting now the results. The mean total time needed for diagnosis was lower for camera mouse, followed by avia cam and mouse. The NASA task load index, uh, where lower scores are better, was 42 for Evicam, followed by Nose with 53 and 60 for Camera Nose. And these results correlated with the degree of satisfaction. There was a significant correlation between time and perceived temporal demand. Overall assessment was better for Evicam followed by mouse and camera mouse. Even though adaptation time was uh, poorer for mouse than for the others, mouse obtained a better rating for prolonged use. So conclusions? In environments with high hygienic demands like this situation, this COVID situation, webcam-based head tracking systems may be useful in providing interaction while requiring nothing to be touched. Enable pathologists to control host light images. Of the three software solutions, examine Ebiocam seems to be the best of those evaluated in this study, followed by nose and finally camera mouse. Further studies integrating speech recognition systems could be performed to achieve an ideal, ideal input value from our holistic perspective, that is ergonomics, performance and safety. So thank you very much for your attention and stay safe.